Earbuds the podcasting documentary is a film that explores the relationship between online content creators and their fans, a relationship that sparked through online media and that continues to succeed in changing people's lives and bringing people together from all across the world. Now honestly I thought I didn't know anything about podcasting before seeing this film yesterday evening, but as it turns out, to my great surprise, I might actually be more familiar with it than I realized. Back in 2010, I started following the YouTube channel of a movie review website called Spill.com, on which they had these extremely hilarious, goofy, but also very informative reviews in which the critics appeared as animated characters, basically as animated versions of themselves. Now of course discovering them on YouTube led me to discover their website, on which they uploaded these longer, uncut, 30-40 to 40 minute versions of their reviews in audio form, and of course I immediately became hooked on those two. Spill.com is defunct now, but two of the original members continue marching on on their newer website called Double Toasted, and another one of them on oneofus.net. Now the reason I'm bringing this up is because I think this was actually the moment, this was actually like the period in my life when my passion for cinema was beginning to reignite, so to speak. Because there was like a good four or five year period when I don't even think I watched any movies at all. I was just not interested in cinema at all. Listening to these podcasts, I wasn't really familiar with the term at the time, I was just considering them movie reviews in general, uh, was really like bringing me back into the game this in a sort of sort of way, without me even I think realizing it back at the, in the time. And you know, that, that really like I think changed my life because I'm pretty certain I wouldn't be the same person as I am today without this. I probably, I most certainly wouldn't be sitting here reviewing movies. Uh, some of you might not even know me or know of me. So, you know, it's a pretty big thing. But obviously you're not here to hear me talk about myself, you're here to listen to me talk about this film. And I think this film is pretty good, but it's good because of different reasons than I was expecting actually. Now if you're expecting like, I don't know, a documentary about the technical aspects of podcasting, or the history of it, like when did this whole phenomenon start, who were the first podcasters, blah blah blah, then you're not going to get that here. And I don't even think that that's like an area about which there is that much to talk about. If there is, maybe there is, I don't think that would make a very interesting documentary, honestly. This documentary is a much more personal account, I would say, of the people presented in it, who relate, very passionately I might add, their experiences over the years. Like how has this, how has this changed their lives? And how has it brought communities of people together from all over the world? How has it eventually led to people uh, traveling across the world to meet each other in person? And there are all of these incredibly honest, uh, uplifting, inspiring stories about friendship, about passion, about hope, about dedication, about dreams, about not giving up, about being there for your friends. Woo. It's truly one of the aspects that really caught me off guard about this film, just how emotionally stirring it can be. Now, I'll be honest with you folks, my heart by now I think is like, it's like bubblegum. It has been chewed up, it has been spat out, it has been stepped on, and I think it's nothing more than just this big black spot on the floor, which has extremely slim chances of ever reanimating. But, and there are movies, there are like tear jerkers that really try to make you weep and some, many times just, there's just no emotion coming out of me, there's just no emotions coming to the surface at all. But then you have this, you have Earbuds, a documentary about podcasting of all things, that kind of made me, during certain moments, like choke up a little bit. And that just to me seems astounding. And I think this is because it's so incredibly human. These people are truly talking about their lives here. They are talking about extremely personal stuff, like overcoming depression, uh, losing friends, uh, coming out of the closet. And uh, all of them talk about how they managed to find remedy in this community of fans they managed to create. And this works vice versa as well. Like they talk also talk about how fans of theirs constantly write to them about how their this form of entertainment of theirs helped them manage to overcome difficult periods in their lives as well. And it's really amazing, it's this very reciprocal relationship they have. The whole film is really well put together, it, it flows so well. There, there wasn't like a, a moment when I felt that the pace unnecessarily slows down or speeds up or anything like that, despite that it does become 
become this sort of emotional roller coaster. At least it did for me. This film was really inspiring, to be honest. It just goes to show how uh, online media can be just so much more than what television used to be, it can be so much more than what radio used to be. It can really be this extremely inspiring like community. It just brought back so much nostalgia for me because that's why I mentioned Spill.com in the beginning. Like, I remember discovering those guys. I remember them inspiring me and wanting me to, to sort of start doing my own thing. And it's the same thing like uh, everywhere. This it really They say it in the movie as well and I think it's really true. Like the internet really makes the world that much smaller but in the best, absolutely the best sense possible. So yeah, I recommend the earbuds. If you're interested in the subject matter as I was, then definitely. Thanks for watching my review. As always, I will see you later with other reviews. Bye bye.